touchdown, but he did get the first down as he's tackled at the one. A third down gain of three yards, and that'll be enough. Smith. And he'll take this one in for a Jags touchdown. Edo Smith with his second touchdown. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. Trying to lay one up deep. And now this is intercepted. My goodness. Picked up by Minka Fitzpatrick. And a great return as he gets this all the way down close to the 30-yard line. Thought he had the pick. Flag comes in for P.I., so cancel it out. Interference. Oh, a killer for them. Thought they had a nice play. Instead, they'll be marching off yardage against them. Buying time to his left. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Jones. A gain of six there on first. The CD, you know, this offense at 11-0 now on the year. A few weeks ago, I remember asking you what kind of percentage chance that you thought they had at staying unbeaten the entire season. I think you said 25%. I'd imagine that number probably grown since then. I would agree with you, and I'm going to actually bump it up to closer to 50%, only because they saw some tough games to come. And keeping that focus throughout the entire season, that's been a really difficult thing to pull off. But so far, they've done it, and they've done it well. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. Looking to throw. Diggs. Touchdown! Stephon Diggs. His ninth touchdown of the season. And the Jaguars are able to widen their lead. If you didn't know it. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And with a three-score lead already, this is not time for a momentum change, so I'd imagine they'd be happy to just take this into the locker room. And an anxious moment or two there, but they do get him down. All right, hang on. We'll jump over halftime. The Jaguars in possession of the lead, and they will get the football as we are underway in the second half. This one taken just inside the 10. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. They'll start the third quarter here on the ground. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave them with a second and three. Kid had a ton of success here so far, but you get the feeling that he might be on the verge of popping one. Yeah, even on that one, there was a little bit of a hole, but it closed there quickly at the end. Staying on the ground, this time it's Smith. Sixty-four yards rushing for him now with a couple of touchdown runs to boot. Well, you certainly have to give a little credit here because they're playing this game now at their pace. This is ball control football, sustained runs, taking their time and making it work. And down he goes at the 45 after a pickup of nine. Nothing fancy on first down, but a very consistent type of a play. Hit that slant. A lot of people call it an extension of the running game, and it can be if that pass is completed, because you hit a guy on the run like that, you often can go for big yardage. Sets him up nicely for second down, staying ahead of schedule. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Going deep for Diggs, and that is caught. Touchdown, Jacksonville. Stephon Diggs, two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Jaguars add six to their lead. In order to lead in a game, you're going to get plenty of contributors, but that's his second touchdown catch of this game. He's one of the key guys in this one. <laughs> 